Hi, my name is George Switzer. Right now we're in beautiful downtown Bensonhurst, Brooklyn at Queen Anne Ravioli and I am a pasta maker. So George, let's talk a little bit about y your origins in Brooklyn. Uh, you've lived here your entire life, right? Yes, born and raised in Brooklyn. Born and raised in Gravesend section of Brooklyn. Then lived in uh, Bensonhurst, uh, Dyker Heights, and now in uh, Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. Did you realize how significant Brooklyn was as a city back then? Or was it just normal to you? No, I, I always realized that Brooklyn was, was a, a great place to live. I mean, I, I always appreciated it for the diversity and, and, and what it had to offer. But, you know, when you're young, you're sort of limited in, in, in what you can appreciate until you've seen more than, than, you, than you already know. Right. You know, and then as you grow and you see more, let's say having gone out of the country and such, you realize what you got here in right. Brooklyn. Exactly. So did you... Uh did you did you did you really get a chance to sit back and appreciate the fact that your city, your area, New York as a whole, was represented so heavily in the media and television? You would see shows. I like person that's from somewhere like Virginia. We didn't really see our city represented in television and media. Yeah, I, I mean, I mean, even when I was a kid, I mean, you you had to be proud and and have a a smile on the corner of your lip when when you talked about Brooklyn. I mean. You know, uh, from Welcome Back, Carter, which if you watch the beginning of that show, I could name you half a dozen spots I used to shop on, really? on 86th Street when they show you the beginning. Fred a pork store, uh, they show you New Utrecht High School. I mean, if you also, um, you know, I mean, a lot, a lot of TV shows represented Brooklyn, you know. And I mean, from when I was a kid, Welcome Back, Carter was one of the first ones.